Are you coming, dude, or what? There we go. Hello, hello, hello. Today's a big day. Um, it's Monday. I don't know when I'll be able to edit this and put it up on the YouTubes. But in real life, today's Monday. <laughs> and it is a big Monday. Naturally, we start out the day with the monster at, uh, well, 440. The alarms are always set for 4.30, but getting out of bed is an issue. So, 4.40 we get outside. He's confused. Um, anyway, today's a big day. Of course, starting out with this clown. Over here, bud. Starting out with this clown. <sighs> Going to train legs because I can, and then go to work. Um, but that's not where the big stuff happens. Where the big stuff happens is after work. And it's gonna be a surprise. I'm not gonna divulge everything just now. Um, because suspense in filmmaking or something. <laughs> uh, anyway, it's early, my brain is not super functional yet. Um, so I'm gonna go get some food and some pre-workout and go to the gym. Because, oh boy. Gotta shake out the cobwebs. Gotta shake out the cobwebs. Okay. <sighs> Let's go do stuff. Big day. Big day. Wired and amped, then I go lift all the weights. Leg day. Leg day is the best day. Could he possibly be louder? Probably. But it'd be tough. It would be tough. All right, leg day is done. Uh, for those of you who saw my last video, I did not do the prowler today. Uh, I always start out with heavy squats. I did sets of three today. Um, I just kept adding on weight until I wasn't super comfortable with my last rep. I got up to 365. First two went up great. The last one, I don't think I set myself properly. Um, but, you know, after, once I hit 315, I keep adding just 10 pounds until I get to my top on days like today. I don't know, I like doing it. Just different kind of stress. And then it was a predominantly glute day. I did uh, like a lunge, step up kind of a deal on the hack squat machine, just reverse. Uh, one legged glute bridges, adductor and abductor work. Some just extra stuff. Not too terribly destroyed, but the butt's gonna hurt later. It's about uh, 6.30 now. Clinic starts a little after eight. So we've got plenty of time to shower, get ready for the day and uh, get ready for that, the big part of the day after work, so. All right, gonna go make some food. And need a shower, very badly need a shower. All right, catch you later. All right, clinic's over. Um, thing about these outpatient continuity clinics is, it's rarely continuity. Um, Every one of my patients today was added onto my schedule 
and new to me after three of my patients canceled all of those three were new to me so yeah outpatient clinic i guess it's kind of is what it is um but they weren't particularly complicated they weren't particularly ill but you know need some help i know a guy who can help <laughs> but i digress um so it's about lunchtime. Gonna go get some lunch and then a small road trip with one more in tow, perhaps. So we'll see. It's a little hint to the uh, the surprise. But for now, gotta get out of the clinic parking lot. <laughs> see you in a bit. Okay, so we're not actually going to PetSmart for PetSmart. Yeah, we are going to the car seat. Oh, we need a car seat at PetSmart. Um, right. Yes, we are adding to the family. No, um, many of you on Instagram thought we were having a kid. Um, jumped the gun ever so slowly there. Uh, <laughs> no, thank you. Um, but we are grabbing. You can park wherever you want. Okay, park over there where there's like a thousand spots. Um, anyway, we are adding to the family. Um, we are getting. Oh, well, they were, it was that way. Okay, well, I don't know what we're doing here. Um, oh, fantastic. Uh, um, we're adding to the family, picking up a corgi. We are. Where? Oh, he gives such well, I said over there. There's like 30 over there. <laughs> we made it. Okay. We're picking up a corgi. Now I have to teach my wife how to park the car. We made it. We made it. Somehow. Let's go get the car seat. Go to get the car seat. Bobby, where are you going? So this is Bobby. She's a uh, 15 week old Pembroke Welsh Corgi and um, kind of a loaf of bread actually. Where are you going? Where are you going girl? Um, named after the immortal Bobby Orr naturally. I feel like Bobby was one of the names that could go male and female so. Um, but we got her at 15 weeks because um, my wife recently took her board exams and it's really, really hard to train a puppy when you're about to take your eye on board exams. So uh, we had my mother-in-law essentially train her. Isn't that right? Seven weeks. What's up? She got her at seven weeks. Oh, we got her at seven weeks apparently. So she's been there for how long? Eight weeks? So she's been with my mother-in-law for eight weeks. Yes. We hit every bump in the road. Where you go? Where you doing? What? 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 Is he really big? He's a big weirdo. She thinks I'm big. She's gonna freak when she sees Bruin. He's a big weirdo, isn't he? So. Hi. Hello. I know. Hello. So, we are about uh, 40 minutes out, and uh, I'm really looking forward to having her and Bruin interact. They, they've met before, um, but I don't think Bruin knows that... Alright, am I going to break for it? Okay, that's fine. I don't think Bruin knows uh, this is her, uh, his sister. So...
We'll see how this goes. After that display of insanity, it seems as though they've calmed down a little. Uh, there's a new device for water that Bruin is not familiar with. Um, Bruin has a giant bowl, and Bobby has an automatically filling water thing, Jake. But undoubtedly, Bruin wants it more. But they're still chasing each other a little bit. And she won't walk a block until I get picked up, huh? We tried. We tried so hard.
Alright, I think they're gonna tolerate each other for a little while. Now our apartment is full of dog shit. Figuratively, not literally. Nobody's pooped in the house yet. Bobby peed right, right when she walked in. But, it is what it is. But for now, <clears throat> back to our regularly scheduled studying. Alright, just like that, it's 9 o'clock. God, what a day. Um, worked out in the morning after taking Bruin out at 4.30, 4.40. Had clinic all day. Went and picked up Bobby. Hung out with her and Bruin. Just watched them. Hey, bud. Just watched them, uh, Interact. <laughs> it's pretty funny. I don't think Bruin has accepted Bobby into the pack yet, but hopefully that changes over the course of the next week or two. And then, uh, yeah, I just spent time with with those those two clowns, and uh, yeah, and that's the day. It's like a person. <laughs> uh, I will always love big dogs. Giant dogs. Or more than giant dogs, I think. Hi, Bru. I don't know why, but he always knows when the camera is pointed at him. He just runs away. <sighs> anyway, yeah. Clinic seems like a week ago. Alright, I'll, I'll, I'll tug your toy. Or I'll throw it, I guess. Okay. There he goes. Yeah, clinic seems like a week ago. It was a long day. It's almost 9 o'clock. I'm tired. I'm gonna go to bed. But yeah, added one more to the family today. So, that's exciting. Alright, I'm out. See you guys in the next video.